Airdorf is famous for the Atari style horror game. <laughs> Extraordinary is an Irish ghost comedy movie. Oh Jesus, Mary and Joseph! Martin, she's floating! She's floating, Martin! No. Airdorf made this game based on that movie. <laughs> Let's compare it to the trailer. My name is Martin. Maybe you could have a chat with my daughter. Just to find out what's up with her. Nostalgic Nokia 3310 check. Bedsheet ghost transition check. Hey, is that Tignotaro? Probably not. Airdorf created five mini games. In this one, the trash bins are possessed, and you have to shake hands with the ghost a few times to win. Thankfully, this is not too hard because the edges loop, like in Pac Man. There we are. Attaboy. Good show. Oh, it's time to collect some ectoplasm. Martin has to let Ghost possess him so he can produce that nasty stuff. There we go. Rido. Well done, chum. The game's protagonist is Rose. She's the film's lead, too. On the farm, Sarah, Martin's daughter, floats vertically, as she does in the trailer as well a little. Exploding goats actually are a thing in the trailer, too. The cause and effect is a bit skewed, but hey, you gotta make a game of something. Casting the spell on Sara actually speeds up this level's timer, which is for the best. Martin's house is actually the first minigame. I don't think the trailer has any moving furniture stuff. It is in the movie though. We just gotta avoid all the cupboards, etc. to progress through rooms, so we can get the plot started. Winter's castle is the final stage. Hear me, powers of the night! Glad the order of the first three sublevels is liberal though. In the final minigame we control a magpie. We try to bash the car of the baddies, who on the other hand try to get away with the floating virgin, dragging her by a leg like a helium-filled blow-up doll, surely the comedic climax of the film. When done, we are rewarded with an end sequence. The evil guy is played by Will Ford. I know him from SNL's McGruber. Turns out he did one of the GTA radio host voices. In the Scoob movie, he's voicing Shaggy. Here he is summoning the devil or whatnot. That's it for Extraordinary. I watched and enjoyed the first half of the movie so far, by the way. Check out the free game on Itch. Until next time, ciao!